hi everyone welcome to the learning lessons youtube youtube channel this video we are going to discuss how to create customizing transport requests within the sap first of all we need to understand why we need customizing transport requests and what it is so customizing transport request contains objects that belong to client specific customizing data what is client specific customizing data which is relevant to the functional activities like storage locations transportations and shipping areas sales information sales area sales office sales groups and finance related activities which are need to configure in the system level so those can those are all comes under customizing data here one more point we need to understand what is client specific okay in the within the sap system there are number of clients so every client defines individual process okay so we need to create this customizing data based on the client specific okay so as per the client settings these requests are automatically recorded in this transport when users perform customizing settings within the system within the sap system okay so what are all those activities so i just note down few activities here from different modules we can see as from sap sd we need to create storage location using this transaction OX09, create sales office using OVX1, create sales group using OVX4 transaction. There are a number of activities in SD. Similarly, FI, we have assigned tax code to GL account using OB40, create payment terms using OBB8, create trading partner using OX15. And from MM also, we, have, we are doing some activities like create commodity code using OVE1, create plant OX10, create transportation zone OVR1. So there are a number of customizing activities within the SAP in all the activities when we performing, when we create the content or when we change the data of customizing data, it will ask the transport request, which is customizing one. Okay. This is the prerequisites for doing these activities. Okay. So now we'll understood how to create customizing transport request. So we need to use SC09 transaction code. So there we have a create option. We need to click and we'll, I'll show all this option in the live system. Okay. So go to SAP system here. Just type SC09 as a transaction and then click on continue button here. So this is the initial screen of transport organizer where we can create the customizing transport. Here we have a create option. Click on create. So in the top, you can see two options are there. Customizing request and workbench request. So we are going to use customizing request and we need to continue to create. We have other option also workbench request, which we already explained in this channel. We can see the link in the below YouTube description. Okay. So since we are going to create customizing request, click on continue this. So this is a create request pop up where we are supposed to provide short description relevant to the activity. Consider I'm going to create plant type it here, create plant. Okay, short description we need to provide and target also we should select. So since we are doing these activities in the development environment, we should select always quality as a target system. So this value will auto populate it since it is configured by the basis team. If it is not auto populated, we need to select from F4 option. <coughs> you can see here uh, it will show the list of target system. There might be number of systems. Uh, you need to select the relevant target relevant quality target system and then click on create okay this target system will not be there in the single systems okay where you are doing practicing or not this target system might not be there okay if you can ignore if it is not there but in the real time environment this target system will auto populate or we can select from a4 option now click on save once you click on save it is created automatically in the within the system you can see this customizing request and target is quality system qs7 and it is modifiable and it is this is a main task under the 800 client is it is created this is my user id and this is the activity which we are going to do under this transport and this is a sub task which will capture our activities within the system that's it about the customizing transport request okay please subscribe learning lessons youtube channel for more content related to this sap Thank you.